Right, hi, hi um, hello internet. This is, um, this is Tom. I'm doing the uh, today. I'm doing the uh, the sun um, the sun crossword. I've already done it um, earlier on. Uh, this is uh, I do the cryptic crossword. Uh, there is um, the advantage of doing the sun. The sun's the second easiest uh, you can get in a daily newspaper, in my opinion. Uh, it does have its moments, however. Um, but the the handy thing about the sun is that it's got both uh, coffee time clues, which are your easy standard clues as well as your cryptics. Uh, it's the cryptics I do, but if you get stuck, go over to the coffee time. Sometimes the coffee <laughs> clues are quite cryptic as well. But anyway, let's get, let's get started. Um, there's only really one um, rule in uh, cryptic uh, crossword uh, clues, and that at either end, possibly the whole of the clue, or maybe none of the clue, has an easy, um, easier definition. Um, so uh, in this case, uh, eight across, lad, tour, ragged. I've already done this um, crossword, by the way, already. Uh, I'm doing, you know, if I if I made you watch me do this live, it'd be like two hours of me banging my head against the. I mean, in fact, it took me half an hour to do this. Um, it'd be half an hour of you watching me bang my head against the table. But anyway, yeah. So eight across um, is lad, tour, ragged, stretchy costume. Now I know, because I've just done this, that stretchy costume is the definition. So at one end, it, normally, there's an easier clue, and the other end confirms uh, in a cryptic way what the other end's telling you. So that's called the definition. I've underlined it for you. Uh, I only, I, the reason that I would normally guess that that would be the definition is because this word ragged here and the fact that lad tor comes up to seven letters. You've got seven here. Ragged suggests, is a word that suggests that something's got a little bit confused or disordered, um, broken up, um, which suggests an anagram. That's an anagram indicator. And this is the anagram fodder, the stuff that we anagram. So lad tor, what I do is I put in, um, I put it in a circle like that uh, until um, until it comes to me and it's leotard which is a stretchy costume so if you anagram lad tour it comes to anagram it because of ragged it comes to a stretchy costume which is leotard so we put that in there okay we're in okay right three down we've got some letters now so that should help us three down uh, enticement in Mumbai titillates. Now this is uh, whenever I see the letter, the word in, or part of, or some, or something like that. It might be what's known as a hidden clue. So you take, and we've got two words next to in, and we've got this a over here. So, and that's the second letter. So if we go one to the left. B-A-I-T, which is bait, which is enticement. To entice something is to bait them. So we have bait. Right, two down. Groom Hal shot 3D photo. We've got an O there. And a 3D photo, I guess this this is this is your definition here. 3D photo. I guessed it. What it's got when you guess what the answer is based on the definition, it's called biffing in uh, crossword E's, uh, and I biffed this. A 3D photo is a hologram, we've got an O there, so it helps me. And if you shot again, suggests something that's disordered. So if you take those, those two, two words there, which add up to eight, anagram, you get anagram groom hal becomes hologram, which is a 3D photograph. So I biffed it and then confirmed it by looking at the wordplay, the cryptic part. That's a hologram. Right, ten across. Good publican offers spirit. So again, I'm guessing as you do these more often, you will start to guess what is the, the definition and what is um, the wordplay. But it's it it is sometimes. I mean, at the moment they're all the, the definitions are all at the end, but you'll get them at the beginning as well. Sometimes the whole clue itself will be a definition, and sometimes there's no definition at all, and when they're really taking the 
taking the uh, mick out of you at that point. But but you, as long as the clue has enough information in it for you to get the get the answer, then it's a good clue. So good publican, right? So good is G. Uh, um, you can reduce good to G. Um, publican is host, and a spirit is a ghost. So we've got ghost. One now. We've got two letters now. L and G. Um, bishop having dieted is rascal. Um, again, that's the definition, rascal. Uh, bishop is often uh, reduced to a B. Um, for some reason or another, I think it's an old-fashioned sort of um, shortened uh, definition. Uh, having dieted makes you lighter, L-I-G-H-T-E-R, with a bishop at the front, makes blighter, which is a rice, which is a rascal. So it's blighter. 16 across. Uh, farm butter from uh, uh, Framlington. Uh, I've. I don't know. I'm just guessing that that's um. That, that there is a hidden ram. It's got an R and M there. I don't know why. Uh, I haven't checked this. I ought to check this on the internet. So if I've got that wrong, I apologise. Uh, it was a guess. Um, uh, but yeah, I don't always take my word for it. Sometimes I've got, I, 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 I'm really sure I've got it right when the setter uh, thinks otherwise. Right, twelve across. Troublingly true, blunt and unruly. We've got T something R. So we've got blunt. So we've got um, an unruly. Right, so troublingly is an anagram indicator. There's a lot of anagrams in um, in the Sun Cryptic, um, which is helpful um, because they're a nice, easy, they're an easier form of clue. If this was the Times, there'd be like three or four anagrams, and the rest of it'd be a nightmare. Anyway, so right, so we got uh, so we got anagram troublingly. Uh, true blunt adds up to nine letters. Uh, so if you anagram that, you get turbulent, which means unruly. And this gives you a, a clue here, T something R, so turbulent should help you get to that answer. We'll always remember, so unruly is again is the definition. They're all at the end at the end of the clue at this at this point. But um, remember both ends of the clue will help you most of the time, will help you um, confirm one you, you, you think you've got got it by one end of the clue. Go to the other end and see if it confirms what, what the first part was telling you, or the other way around. Right, four down. We've got good to eat, editor given terrible bile. So again, we've got, we've got, and this is an interesting, we've got, we've got good to eat is the definition. Uh, and uh, editor is ed, given terrible bile. Now bile, so it's given, ed is given bile, terrible. Terrible means anagram it up. And so if you take those letters there and anagram it, it becomes edible. Right, 11 across. Monk gets Romeo into trouble. So we've got, well, that's the, at last we've got, um, we've got a definition at the beginning of the clue. So monk, I guess this because I've got a B here. Uh, another word for a monk is brother. But let's confirm it by looking at the other end. Um, Romeo into trouble. Romeo is part of the international call sign, you know, NATO call sign. Romeo is, you know, Juliet Bravo, all that sort of stuff. Uh, Romeo is R, but R into trouble. Uh, another word for trouble is bother. I put an R into it, it makes brother, which is monk. So that's. Of course, if you get into this, might seem really. If you do, if this is your first time doing a cryptic crossword, you may think, "My God, I'll never do this." But over here, you've got the easier clues, which not aren't always easy. Sometimes a cryptic's easier than the, the coffee because it, like I say, each end confirms the other most of the time. Six down. I like the four-letter ones. Um, they're fun. Bachelor has wild party. 
Uh, bah, 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 bah. So Bachelor is uh, Bachelor has ah yeah. So we've got another an anagram. Right, party is the definition. Got another an anagram indicator. I'll put brackets around it. Says anagram indicator. Uh, so anagram has. I put it with Bachelor B. But a B with an anagram of has makes bash, which is a party. Right, seven down. Uh, become thin as English in conflict. So um, I'm a little bit unsure about this one, but it, it does seem to work. Um, in, a conflict is war with English. Short for, e is short for English, but E into war makes wear. So sometimes when you say like metals wearing thin, do you see what I mean? So to wear is a process that makes something thin. And it's a bit weak. I'm not 100% sure of it, but we'll, we'll see. We'll confirm it by seeing whether nine across works. Take out some butter as expired. So uh, take out is the definition. Some butter as... So we've got some again. Do you remember what I said earlier on about hiddens? If you see something that says some part of in, look at the in between the letter the, the words in the let in the the letters between words. So we've got E R A S E, which is erase, which means take out. If you erase somebody, you've taken them out. All right, five down, and that works with all the letters we had from Bash and where. Five down, journalist on. Dark sweet ale. Uh, a sweet ale is a um, is a porter, and uh, a journalist is a rep reporter. So a dark sweet ale is a porter. If if you're into your beers. And reporter is a journalist. Right. 13 down, beginning with you. One going round on this contraption. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. So um, this is... Now, when you see a, a question mark at the end, what they tend to suggest, even though cryptic cross was all quite tricky, what they're really suggesting is that this clue is a little bit weird. Um, it is sort of it's a double definition but it's sort of not so con contraptions one end of the clue it's the, and one going round is the uh, so cycle to cycle something's going round uh, uni is one uh, makes unicycle which is a contraption so that's I wouldn't have been able to get that unless I had that U there I wouldn't have stood a chance um I'm not the world's greatest um, cryptic crossword player, otherwise I'd probably be doing um, something more difficult than the, the, the sun. Um, I, I do enjoy the, the telegraph's probably my the most um, serious, enjoyable um, cryptic crossword I do, but the it's re for beginners, it's much better to start with the sun or the mirror. Um, because it's it helps you more. It's less cryptic. Um, as you can see, they're very cryptic, but you should see the times. The times is doubly cryptic. All right, 17 across. Protecting love, suffer evil attack. Um, the a... An evil attack is a curse. I guess this one. So what I did was put it in little incursion, which is an evil um, attack. Let's see if I can. I'm putting it in little when I don't really. I'm when I'm not really sure. I put them in little letters. Um, it did work out because I got all the cross the crossing um, uh, words as well, but um, I still don't quite understand it. Let's see if we can work it out. Um, an evil attack is a curse, but it doesn't. It's not. Comp Pleated. Um, 
No, I don't get it. Anyway, let's try 18 to 18. Oh, there was a guess that works out for me. So if I, I put them in, if I'm not sure about it, I put them in little letters so that I can put, I can erase them and put bigger letters once, if I actually get it. But now I think that's a C. So I try 18 down and see if the answer begins with C. So fish taken by German geese, German geezer. Uh, a fish is a cod. Uh, German is G-E-R. Put the two together makes codger, which is geezer. So it does look like incursion is incursion is the answer. So uh, right, twenty three across. Uh, cooking pie does for TV instalment. Well, TV instalment is episode. Um, yeah, look, cooking anagram indicator. Cooking is an anagram indicator. Pie does adds up to seven letters. Anagram them up, makes a TV install, which is episode. So pop that in there. Alright, 21 down. I love the four letter, letter ones. Most important, water pipe. Now this is known as a double definition. So put a comma in and underline both ends. So it's something that's most important, a word that is most important, and a word that means water pipe. And we've got an I there, so we know that's main. So it's a water main and very important. Right, uh, 21 across. Um, some cameleers in skirmish. So we, we know we've got some, that suggests there's a, there's a hidden. So somewhere in these letters there's something means skirmish. And we got melee there in cameleers. Malay means fighting. Skirmish means fighting. Right, 14 down. Um, something valued in limo hero pranged. Pranged means have an accident. So you're mucking up the letters in lim limo hero, which is eight letters, limo hero. And something valued is heirloom. We've got letters, so we can tell it's heirloom. Fifteen down, survived cold, uh, married outside uh, Bury or Bury, Bury. So uh, I can't remember how I did this. Survived cold, uh, married. So married is wed. Outside. So it's we've got an e there. So it's the word wed is outside something else. And it looks like wintered, so inter ah, interred is buried. Wintered, which is survived cold. 14 across, three letters. Something valued in, uh, no, no, 14. Man said to fell with an axe. To fell with an axe is to hew. And, right, okay, right, where are we next? Oh, we got an L here, 22 across. Sulfur tablet requires drop of liquid. Uh, sulfur is S, I believe, on the periodic table. Tablet is a pill, makes spill, which is a drop of liquid. You've dropped liquid. So it's spill. 20 down, look after student in den. Um, so student is L for learner. In... Uh, Den is a lair, and I don't know where the look after bit comes from. But I'm popping it in. I may have that wrong, but I don't think so. It fits. Uh, I just don't understand why air means look after. But anyway, just bear, bear with me. I probably got it right, but if I haven't, I apologise. Right, 19 across. Song indeed played later. Um... Later, played later is delayed. The right, indeed, right. So in ah, oh, this is I love these. This is like a new type of um, part of a clue now. Indeed is one one word, but it's they split it into two, saying inside in something is in deed. So you've got d e e. There's your deed. 
So something is in deed and a song uh, a, pl a song is a lay. So you've got lay indeed, delayed. 19 down, uh, sprint in style and it is um, dash. Uh, I don't know why it's in style, but anyway, it's all, um, I think I've got that right, it's the style bit, but anyway, yeah, um, anyway, that's your, that's your cryptic, uh, this is the, um, the sun, cryptic crossword, uh, it's also a simple crossword as well, uh, I hope you enjoyed it, that's, um, it's a beginner's, um, a demonstration, uh, for beginners. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one.